next we are discussing the risk management so what is a risk it is uncertainty that may be occur in choice due to cost action and risk is something which causes heavy loss so in this risk management the process of making decision based on the evaluation of the factor that threats to the business so risk is identifying the problems what will be happen inside the product so after identifying the risk the risk can be eliminated with the help of risk management so the next one what are the process will happen inside the risk management so risk management process is continuous till the product or till the project will completed and the second one in this risk planning phase is required to minimize the avoid in the risk I mean, to minimize or avoid the risk so the each and every time the risk is monitored and mitigated in the risk monitoring phase risk management is a iterative process in this we are having a two characteristics of risk one is uncertainty so what is the meaning of uncertainty the risk is may happen or may not be happen that is there is no 100% risk or there is no 100% is not having any risk so it may be happen or it not be happen loss what is a loss mean the risk become a reality and unwanted consequences of loss are, can occur inside the product development so next one the risk management types first one is project risk so what is the meaning of project risk it can be affect the budget schedule staffing resource and requirement of the project and when the project risk become a severe then the total number of cost of the product get increased so second one technical risk so technical risk it will affect the quality and timeliness of the product to be produced and finally it can be real the implementation may be difficult or it may be impossible so this is a representation of technical risk the next one business risk so what is meaning of business risk the feasibility of the software to be built is threatened and if it is to become real the risk project or product may be occur it's not a suitable thing to the customer requirement and market risk so what is meaning of market risk building the external extern uh, sorry building a excellent product or system that no one really wants strategic risk so strategic risk overall business strategy for the company can affect sales risk no? means it should not understand how it will be sale to the customer so it is representing a sales risk so market means how it will be produced to the market sales risk how it will be sale to the customer the next one business risk also classified into a number of subtypes first one management risk so management risk the senior management uh, can be changed to the uh, lower level so automatically the product development phase having some difficulties budget so if you are identifying the bus budget risk if you are having a high budget the product is reduced in the low budget means it will be failure and also if you are providing the low budget but the product actual product cost is high automatically it will be identified as a risk budget risk the next one known risk so if you are having software development plan so we we can identify and also we can match we can identify the technical risk and also the business risk by using the reliable sources predictable risk means it will be extrapolated from the past project experience so a predictable risk means we can identify the risk from the past product development unpredictable it will not identify the past project or it no will not identify the technical team so it will be unpredictable from the uh, risk the next one uh, risk management in this risk management the risk can be identified in the systematic approach to specify the threats to the project plan by identifying the predictable risk the manager can take a first step towards to avoid the risk and it will be controlled by when it is necessary uh, what are the approaches will identify the risk first one generic risk so what are the risk can be happen next one product specify risk so the, the pro particular product having a this type of uh, risk can be occur it will be designed or it will be fixed by the organization or any other company so in this representation we can identify the product specific risk 
the next one preparation of the list item with the checklist representation first one product size so that if you are having a overall size in the software to be built it will be exceed so you can identify it is a risk business impact so you can identify the marketplace and the sales representation with the help of your drug management so that is a business impact next one customer characteristics so the customer uh, having a uh, some requirement for developing a software product but the developer is not communicate the proper requirement the customer he will not pro communicate properly to the developer and also the developer cannot communicate the product development representation to the customer means it automatically provide the risk in the customer characteristics so next one process i definition so the how the process will be executed in the representation of uh, software that can be developed development environment we can identify the sustainable environment for developing a software product technology so it will be suitable technology we can check to develop the product and what are the size of the uh, staff and how the experience of each and every staff we can identify it is also one of the representation to identify the risk in the risk management so next step is creating risk component and drivers list so uh, risk component what are the risk component and drivers list will used for probability to the occurrence this impact the project can be analyzed the next one uh, risk component and drivers so what is the risk component Pro performance risk cost risk support risk and schedule risk so performance means it will be identified the how the product is performed cost what are the uh, amount will be uh, used for the particular product development support list for certainty and uncertainty representation of the software development process and schedule risk so at correct time we are delivering the product or not it will be representing the schedule list then is uh, next one is the impact of uh, each and every risk driver on the risk component is divided into four impact level first one is negligible so it will not uh, taken care by the risk management and marginal it is also is a border part so no no need to worry about the marginal and critical is means uh, we have to consider the risk identification or risk management we have to concentrate and catastrophic is a very high representation of risk management surely we can have some changes in the development phase so this is a representation of four impact level the risk drivers can be accessed as impossible improbable and probable and frequent so impossible mean so it will not having a representation improbable may be or probable is having some deviation and frequent mean so uh, consecutively it will be occur in the software risk management representation so overall risk project risk so it having a identified by the customer managers formally committed to support the project all end users uh, is committed to the project all requirements will satisfied or understand by the customer as well as software developer developer how customers can be involved fully in the definition of the requirements so these are the overall checklist for identifying your risk in the risk management systems so and also additionally we are having end user having a realistic expectations and project scope scope table stable and software engineer team have a six mix of skills and also the project requirement stable or not so these are the representation of risk identification so what is the thing is if you are identifying the any deviation or any mistakes or any uncertainty level of your software development suddenly we are moving to correct that uh, risk in our software product so how can you correct the software product in the representation it is also called as risk management thank you